Hey, how's everyone doing? So, Guns N' Roses busted out another really cool song tonight. This was in Oklahoma City at the Thunders Arena, and they played Dead Horse. This is the first time they played Dead Horse since 1993. It was actually the last show with like the old man and Slash and Duff and all them, and it's like the most famous performance of the song because there's a pro shot video of it and everything. And one thing that's really unique about the song, so the beginning intro and the outro of the song have Axel on acoustic guitar. One of the big questions you're going to be having is, did Axel play a guitar on this performance? And the answer is no. And I didn't really expect him to play guitar, and, but it's no big deal. It would have been a cool touch. There was actually no acoustic guitar at all. Slash was pretty much just playing his electric the entire time. And during the acoustic parts, he basically just lightly picked his electric guitar. Now. This song has been on the alternate list, on the set list, this whole entire leg of the tour. Who knows why they picked it tonight, why they decided to do it tonight. I was like low-key freaking out when I saw they, they were playing it. So, how was the performance? Now, I don't want you to take this review too seriously because in all in all, it's just awesome that they played the song and it doesn't really matter how bad or good it sounded, but honestly, it was pretty shaky. Um, Axel forgot a line or two in the intro. And then Slash actually seemed like he was having some difficulty, like um, knowing where he was at in the song and like when to start the next verse and stuff like that. They had a lot of timing issues, it seemed like, but it's no big deal. You know, I, like I said with Locomotive, I feel like once they play it a few times, they'll definitely get it down. I was kind of surprised when I compared it to Locomotive, how they had more issues with this song than I did the first time they played Locomotive because... That song is like way longer and way more articulate. You, th you would think they would have way more problems with that one. Axel's voice sounded good. He used his Mickey Mouse voice throughout most of the song, and most people would take that as a negative, but it honestly sounded fine. I don't have any problems with it. I thought he nailed the high notes, and it seemed like he hit the high notes way easier than he did back in the early 90s, which is kind of interesting to see. This is one of my favorite GNR songs, and it actually is my favorite music video that they've ever done, because Use Your Illusion Tour is like one of my favorite things about GNR, and the video for Dead Horse is just a bunch of clips of them playing on the Use Your Illusion Tour with Pro Shot, and it's kind of similar to the Live and Let Die video, but I think it's even better. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please tell me what you guys thought of the performance, what you think about them playing the song tonight, or if you were shocked, or if you thought they were going to play it, if you like the song, if you hate the song. Please let me know in the comments. I appreciate your guys' feedback. Please comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.